When models have very accurate face tracking, toggling expressions via a button can become more noticeable as you pause to look down at your device. By utilizing VTube Studio's hand tracking abilities, you can instead toggle with gestures, treating your model like a real-life puppet, for fast and intuitive expressions. This feature does not need to be rigged into your model. Any hotkey, such as expressions, items, model movement, and more can be assigned to a gesture in VTube Studio. You can even combine multiple toggles together by combining gestures with each hand. Memorizing your toggles takes practice, so make it easier by assigning them to gestures that make sense to you. For example, this gesture for teary eyes resembles playing the world's smallest violin. All you need is a webcam for hand tracking. It can be the same one you use for face tracking, or if you use a phone or vBridger for tracking you will need to use a webcam in addition to it. In that case I recommend using the only hand tracking setting to reduce resource consumption on your PC. You can also use a lower setting of FPS and resolution as gesture triggers don't require that much accuracy. To assign the hotkey, open the gesture trigger menu. Choose the trigger you want and pick left or right. Allow mirrored gesture if you want to be able to use either hand. Or, leave it unchecked if you want to assign different hotkeys to each hand. This is a great option for arm toggles. For expression hotkeys, turning on deactivate expression when gesture not detected anymore will make it so you will only make the expression while making the gesture, similar to real puppeteering. However for item scenes and other various hotkeys, this won't work, the gesture merely toggles it on and off even if you have this checked on. The seconds until detection slider determines how quickly it will react to your gesture. If you find yourself accidentally triggering the hotkey, increase this so it only happens on purpose. The trade-off is that it won't be as responsive. This is mostly an issue with gestures like the open hand or index finger which tend to trigger without intention, while things like the peace sign can have very fast response time without accidental triggering. For some toggles, you may want the facial features to change smoothly while other aspects like item scenes or arm toggles trigger instantly. To do this, assign multiple hotkeys to the same gesture, but change the fading time in the hotkey settings. Make sure you have the same length of gesture detection for both or they may fall out of sync. VTubing is a modern form of puppetry. In the same way that learning to over-exaggerate your expressions and movement can bring more life to your model, utilizing gestures can take that same concept to the next level. If you found this video helpful, like, subscribe, and follow Moon's other socials for more VTubing tutorials and advice.